boobs are massive. Oh yeah, let's see. Oh my god. Oh, for God's sake. I fell for it too. What? Firefly, season one, episode 11, and it's called Trash, and it's going to be a planet of trash, isn't it? Where all the rubbish goes. If I am right, I am officially a genius. We're not talking about it being almost the end of the episodes, because in my mind, it's just going to keep on going on, and on, and on, and on. The same as with every other episode, I'm very, very, very excited, so we're just going to start watching right, right now, after you subscribe, and like, and comment, and check out Patreon, and all that fun stuff. You know what it is. Firefly season one, episode 11, trash and play. Oh, he's naked. Why is he naked? He's probably naked. He hasn't even got pants on. Yeah. That went well. <laughs> Let's see. 72 hours. Okay, I've got that All right, I got it. He had a tattoo. Oh, I might sound nasally because I'm not well again. Something's different. Something uh, is... Yep. Something is... Uh... The beard! Oh, you shaved <laughs> off your soup catcher! Yep. Soup catcher! Wear that ugly chin wig to the grave. <laughs> yeah, so did I. Chin wig. What the hell am I thinking? I gotta introduce you to the missus. You have fallen from our noble bachelor ranks. Aww. She just sort of swept me off my feet. Oh, that's the best way. I want you to meet my Bridget. Oh, God, it's Mrs. Reynolds. <laughs> you guys have met. Yes. I didn't think we'd see her again. I did think would it be her, but no. They must be married a while now, surely, if he shaved off his beard for her. God damn it, why is she back? Burn the land. Policy. You can take the sky from me. It's your wife, Monty. Huh? I married her, didn't I? You ain't the only one. Oh, you wasn't watching. <laughs> Ow. Yeah, you should have killed her when you had the chance. Here now, I'm knocking it off. Hear him in the background. Knock it off. <laughs> She hits me by surprise, got on my ship, and then tried to steal it out from under me. Yeah, why has she not done that to him yet? You're a liar, Malcolm Reynolds. I ain't never got to telling you his name. Yes. I shaved off my beard for you, devil! Oh, I know. Imagine doing that and it's not even your real wife. If someone wants you to shave off your beard, then they don't really love you. Relax, I'm not going for a gun or anything. And lipstick are a dangerous combination, if I recall. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just don't want you pulling a pistol out of, of anywhere. Where did he just check? Can't miss a place you've never been. <laughs> Your boobs are massive. You are a tweaked one, you are. I'm really hot. Start walking. Walking, walking where? Anywhere away from him. <laughs> this is my scrap of nowhere. You go on, find your own. You can't just leave me here on this lifeless piece of crap moon. Yes, you can. Seriously, Mel, you gotta give me a ride. Woman, well, you are completely off your nut. She is. It's gonna cut Monty and his crew in, but you screwed that, Royal. I've got the layout, entrance code. Don't listen to her. I'm handing you a fortune on a gold platter, sweetheart. Don't you want to hear the details? There's so many women that think they can do that. So many. Be a total asshole and then... Be like that and wrap you around their little finger. Tell me you got into a fight with Monty. <laughs> I don't particularly want to talk about it. We got work to do. Let's shut up. Oh, no, you need to tell him. You need to make him aware. <laughs> She's always delicately pouring tea. I offered you tea. After inviting me into your shuttle of your own free will, which makes two events without precedent, which makes me more than a little skittish. Yeah. I haven't had a client for three weeks. We go where the work is. There are plenty of worlds where both of us could work. We used to visit them, remember? Yeah, but I don't think he wants you to work. Are you saying I'm doing this deliberate? Yes. On account of you? Yes, you are. Just... I'm not accusing you of anything, Mal. Hey, it's just... no, let's set a course for the planet of the lonely, rich, yet appropriately hygienic man. <laughs> I can't seem to find work as companion. I might as well become a petty thief like you. I didn't mean petty. What did you mean? Swashi. she. Well, you called her a whore. You know you haven't been after serious work. No serious work? She looks different in this episode. I... What? He loves you. Nothing. Tell her. Oh, for God's 
sick. All right. Tell me more about this job of yours. Did he know she was in there? I don't like her. The original handheld laser pistol. One of only two known to still exist. Hamer got lucky, picked it up during the war for nothing. I hope she doesn't stay for good. You're asking yourself, if I've got the security codes, why don't I go in, grab it for myself? I was wondering, what's she doing on the ship? Yes. How did she get here? She hit. I don't recall oh. pulling over. <laughs> if she's got security codes, why don't she just walk in and grab it herself? <laughs> oh, Jane. <laughs> Idiots. That's what you'll all be if you trust her. You got something better? I least should be willing to hear it. Mandisha Sagwa. I really need my book. Uh, I ain't asking you to trust her. Walk her up. with her on the inside the whole time. All you gotta do to be a rich woman, hun, is get over it. Or you can just lock her up and do it without her. <laughs> I'm in. <laughs> She's got balls. She's a liar and no good will come of her. Girl folk ain't to be trusted. Jane is a girl's name. <laughs> well, Jane ain't a girl. <laughs> I show her good and all. I got man parts. Oh yeah, let's see. I'm trying to think of a way for you to be cruder. I just, <laughs> it's not coming. Afraid. Why the captain is trusting that boohoo on the poor fool. Not her, Jane. Jane's afraid. Afraid? Since when? Since Ariel. Afraid we'll know. Oh, she knows. Of course she knows. She knows everything. I've booked a few choice clients. Should help me get my mind off of Mel's descent into lunacy. Zoe. Oh, why is nobody watching her? Just be careful. See you when we're wealthy. <laughs> hmm. That is not going to happen. You and Mal will split off and shuttle too as we make our approach. You ready? What's with the flowers? Hamer's throwing a big party this weekend, so you should have no trouble blending in with the hired help who'll be there setting up. Oh, got it. It shouldn't be a problem, unless someone has been less than truthful. No, you're in. He forgives too easy. I don't. I hold a grudge for ages. You chuck it in the garbage. Ah. Oh, yeah. You hit one little button and the drone whooshes off with the trash. Uh-huh. Wow. Brilliant. Brilliant plan. Thanks. Except it's idiotic. How? Once I override the standard guidance protocol, I can tell that disposal bin to go wherever we want. Yes. And where would that be? The Here. loneliest piece the of ship. desert we can find. Oh. <laughs> and that's where we saw a mile naked. And we'll get to the bin. I know it's deliberate, but I really don't like her. They make me not like her. Clear. For something that's so well protected, it seems too easy still. Don't take your eyes off of her. Oh, that's pretty. Let's get to work. Yeah. She's being naughty. Careful, it's hot! Grab it, watch, hold it steady! Kaylee's a genius. <laughs> He's trying. Oh, he's actually out. He's out. You! You found her. <sighs> you brought back my wife. Oh my god. <laughs> Solid time. Yeah, he looks at You've returned to me the only thing I truly treasure. Then this is a day I'll feel good to be me. Well, let me take your, your pistol then. I promised him 800 square. I'd be embarrassed not to make some recompense. In, in my study, I... Your pistol? Well, you disappeared the same day as Heinrich. I saw you two talking and I thought, but after they found his body... They killed Heinrich? She did. Yes, he wasn't useful anymore. I never stopped looking. That's the thought that kept me alive. Oh, please. Someone shoot her. <laughs> we gotta move fast. Yeah, you might come back and hug us in the act. <laughs> that was so awkward. <laughs> you don't want him to know the truth. Unlike all the other, I'm gonna go with... Oh, she... Will you turn around and watch her? 
Your real husband? Congratulations. Anything else you want on your tombstone, you piece of crap? He's a piece of crap. We're stealing your priceless Lassiter because that's what we're doing. Don't ask me about the gun, no, because that's new. <laughs> Yolanda, please just stop. Oh, he's going. He's going with it. Don't look at me like that. He's actually leaving with it. <laughs> Okay, got it. Oh, 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 he almost got squashed. Did you think I was a princess? That I would stay locked up here in the tower with you? Nobody really cares. I hoped. You're a rutting fool. What a shame, that poor man. Go! Go! that. He did it. How long have you been with him? We are not together. He's my husband. Well, who in the damn galaxy ain't? <laughs> <laughs> Just leave her. You don't need her. If you had half a brain, you'd have called the feds the minute you saw me. Oh, I did. Oh, he did. Emergency signal. For kidnappings and the like. <sighs> I love you, Yolanda, but I couldn't think for a second that you actually came here for me. That would be them now. Oh. Men. Men? Did she just say men? <laughs> Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I'll do anything you want me to. You know how I can make you feel. You're embarrassing yourself. It is pretty embarrassing. Hey, to bring up our imminent arrest during your crazy time, but we gotta go. Why? You should have just left without her. Whoa. She's running weird. She's got a good kick on her, though. Oh yeah, they need her to sell it, don't they? I think. My name's not Yolanda. Never entered my mind it was. I don't think he cares what your name is. I thought this is a decent man. Struggling to get by with the barest necessities on his private floating island. <laughs> I thought it would help. I thought if I had everything, then I wouldn't want... Heinrich the security programmer. <laughs> I've forgotten his name. Oh, jeez. I should have killed her. Still loves you, treachery and all. I can't have him walking about. I don't feel one bit sorry for her. You must be loving this. <laughs> yes, I am. A little bit. I've seen you without your clothes on before. Never thought I'd see you naked. Aww. You'll ever change? Nope. Yes, but not you. Cheer up, Weepy. You made yourself a boatload of hard cash. Weepy. <laughs> Question the meaning of life on a floaty island of your own for a while. <laughs> I want a floaty island. You won't tell anyone about me breaking down. I won't. Then I won't tell anyone how easily I got your gun out of your holster. Oh, for God's sake. You just may be the most gullible fool I ever marked. <laughs> I fell for it too. You're not gonna catch my crew with their trousers down. Can't turn, not getting any tug from the aft alternator. That don't make no sense. Unless... Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, everyone go find her. Oh, dirty, dirty heart! <sighs> yeah, you better run! <laughs> Where is it? Oh, it's not it. Ooh, it's a nada. I put on the big act, storm away in a huff, then I fly off, wait for you to double cross Mel, beat you to the rendezvous spot, and grab the loot before you can get to it. You didn't see it coming? No, I didn't. <laughs> I like it. That we were playing you from the second Mel took you out of that crate. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's where you belong. I can't do this. I have a condition. She has a condition. <laughs> that's what they all say. Can you move your arms and legs? <gasps> They're not moving. <laughs> if you paralyzed him. How much did they offer you to sell out me and River on Ariel? How much? Yeah, it was a lot. Anybody there? <laughs> Anybody else? <laughs> Odds are you'll be under my knife again. So I want you to understand one thing. I will never ever harm you. Aww. I don't care what you've done. I don't know what you're planning on doing, but I'm trusting you. Because I don't see this working any other way. What did he just inject you with? <laughs> also, I can kill you with my brain. What? <laughs> what? Were they all in on it, or was it just Anara? 
Should I start with the part where you're stranded in the middle of nowhere or the part where you have no clothes? All according to plan. He's not even hiding it. <laughs> you had a key role to play in this. How sad would you have been if you hadn't gotten to play it? Oh, are they going to kiss? <gasps> All according to plan. Wash! <laughs> what? Okay. And your pee pee's out. Everyone can see it. Good day. Well done, everyone. Good teamwork. <laughs> I thought it was just Donata that was in it and she did it all by herself. It must have been them all. I'm so very, very glad that that, whatever her name is, Mrs. Reynolds ended up in the bin at the end because I don't like her and I don't want her back in any other episodes. That's enough. No more. Does it mean they're all rich now? Because that once they sell that pistol gun thing, then, then that it was a big amount that they were going to get. I can't remember what it was or if it even said, but yeah, it was meant to be a lot. Enough to buy a floating island, he said. And Nara and Mal are so, 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 so close to just being together. Maybe not so much Jane and River. <laughs> Maybe that'll come in the next episode. How cute was what Simon said to Jane? He was basically like, it doesn't matter what you do to me, you'll always be safe on my table. Shows what kind of man he is, what kind of doctor he is. Well, I'm going to go because I'm just going to go and watch the next episode right now. So this is going to be like the shortest outro ever. <laughs> like, subscribe, comment, Patreon, all that stuff. You know what to do. And thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.